Hey, what's up YouTube? I hope everybody's having a great day. Today I want to cover the importance of a good lease agreement. If you're new to this channel, check out my other videos. I talk about real estate, I talk about ways to save money, DIY, I review some tools and things of that nature. So right to the point here. Folks, if you rent any property, if you have single family home, a multi-unit, anything like that, you want to have a very good lease agreement. I just wanted to share an anecdote, this story that just, this event that just happened a couple days ago. I get a text message from my tenant and she says that, hey, uh, the main sewer line has been clogged. And I said, okay. And she said, I already called out um, somebody to to snake it through to, to clear the line. I'm like, okay. So this is what we find out. Basically her son, took a bunch of cat litter and paper towels and flushed it down the toilet. Ended up clogging up the whole main sewer line, leaving the house. They had to snake it 110 feet under underground to the main sewer in the street. Why am I telling you this? In my lease agreement, I say that any clogs that are due to negligence of tenants are tenants' responsibility. Now, normally, service call like this in our area would run you somewhere between $150 to $200 for somebody to come out and snake something out. It's not, not the cheapest thing, but it's not the worst thing ever. Here's why I'm telling you this. Because I have this agreement, because I have protected myself, unfortunately, my tenant has called one of the most expensive sewer guys in our town. They charge her nine hundred fifty dollars to do this job i just shook my head i, I felt really bad for her and um, at, at the same time I'm, I'm glad i have this clause to protect myself um it's a shame that she spent so much money as a goodwill i did credit her two hundred dollars just to to help her out on this one and i said i'll do annual um routine cleanings of the main sewer line so that should help her and she was grateful about that but listen landlords if if something happens to you like this and a tenant calls somebody out they will stick the bill to you you will be responsible i could have been out 950 bucks if i didn't have that clause if my tenant didn't have that understanding that it's their responsibility so i wanted to get that out there Make sure you guys have good lease agreements. Make sure your tenants are aware of the process. And also, this is a, le a lesson learned for me as well. I should have done a better job communicating better um, service providers to use for my tenants. So I think I'm going to make like a magnet thing for their fridge. If your sewer clogs up, call this, call this guy instead of the other guy. So getting that out there, hopefully you found this useful. If you did, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, check out my other content. We'll see you next time, guys. Thank you.